Good morning, plumbers. Good morning, world. Good morning, Angelo. Good morning. Are you ready? If you don't know, we do everyday plumbing. The good, the bad, and the ugly. First day on the job, he's already <laughs> screwing up. <laughs> you know how it's wrapped in, right? I like you show me one yeah, time. I will, next time you unwrap it the way you, I'll show you, because this, this is why you're having struggles. Right now, don't pull that. We got furniture on this thing here, dude. I'm not kidding. Here's the plan. We're going home now. Oh, you didn't see the yeah, baby yet. Yeah. We ain't got time for that. We're trying to get done so we can go surfing. Come on, put that in the side door. Shut the water off at the meter and blow all the water lines out. Hot, then cold. Or check that. Yeah, hot, then cold. All right. I'm going to get a compressor in the truck. That's the plan. This way we ain't got to take it off the truck. Right to the hood, good there. Yep. Here you go. Good. Yeah, this side is the city side. Turn this one on first. There you go. Wrap it all the way around so them holes match up. Go the other way, babe. It should be easy. There you go. Off. And shut this one off too. Keep going. No. Go until it stops. Bang, beautiful. shut the power off to the hot water heater. It's an electric hot water heater. We gotta shut the power down before we winterize the house. Now what I like to do is hook up the hot water heater, put it in the drain. So look, I'm gonna expedite emptying this tank, which I just shut the electric off to it. Yeah. I hooked the pump up to it. So I'll have to wait. Undo your hose, the other end in the toilet, under the, under the seat, and make sure it goes all the way down the hole. And put the lid on top of it, because this comes out with a lot of force, and we don't want no, uh, no mess. It doesn't go down that far, right? Right. Just yeah. Make sure you hold that. When we do this, you're going to be babysitting that, because I already had that pop out once here. Thank God I'll stand right here. But before we do all that, go down and get me a screwdriver. The green one. Yeah. And we've got a rag out, right? What do you put that bucket? 
I didn't grab the bucket. I might have left, left it sit right there. Alright. We're gonna start up here on the third floor. Is this thing bent? So what I like to do, instead of just waiting for this thing to drain, I'm gonna hook the compressor up. We're gonna expedite this whole situation. Get some air. So I'm gonna open this up here to drain it with by gravity. If I have any problems, or you have any problems, this is how you would turn it off. Tight, righty tighty. All right, check it out. All right, check it out. Let's see where the screwdriver is. That's all goes on there. All right? Yep. All right, starting to drain now. So now I'm gonna plug this in. I want you to sit there and babysit this thing. It's a little noisy. I don't want to empty it out on the floor. So I'm going to run downstairs and start. Alright. Oh, you look at it. Now, put the seat up and we'll keep the seat on. Here you go. This is where you end up when you're big time. On the beach. A little bit of surf. We're going to try to hit the surf after these winterizations today. That's the goal. Let me unplug it, right? Yeah. So the track tank is even empty. Nice and empty. Beautiful. So here's what we do. It's unplugged. Can you shut that the hose big off here? No. All right, where is it? Let's shut this down so no more leaks. Okay? Mm -hmm. I had a change up outside. I'll hook the compressor up to the anti-frost bib, which I forgot doesn't work. So I gotta hook it up to the shower head down there. I'll show you. Okay. Here's this. We can get rid of this pump now. Oh. Right outside. Don't spill no water. Okay. Let's go water in. Still probably right. Yeah. Get your end of the hose. Keep them together so it doesn't spill no water. Tie these two together. And these can both go downstairs. I'm gonna come down with you because I'm gonna show you what I did. And then we can start blowing this place out. I don't want to tell everybody that I'm trying to rush because I want to go surfing, but I wouldn't do that. And was to uh, blow it out from here, but it's blowing the air right out the uh, anti-siphon, which isn't too bright on my part. So we're going to start over. I got the shower ready to go inside. In the winter, it's cold here, right? Is it cold here? Oh, it's beautiful. Well, in the real world, stuff freezes up. So what we got to do, I, say, I try to say it every video, when we use the pump. Empty it out. Empty the pump out. There you go. Empty it out, dump it out. More importantly, not only roll the hose up, empty the hose, drain the hose. You want the, the frozen hose on a job when you need it? No bueno. There it is. See how I rolled that up nicey nice? Roll the other one up and throw them in that red bucket, okay? I'll hook up the compressor inside. I did this last year too. It doesn't work on the anti-siphon bit. So I just, I just bring in my little gizmo to here. Put a, take the shower head off and we're ready to go. Alright. You're gonna be my you're gonna be my valve man. I'm gonna say open it, open. I'm gonna blow the water, cold lines out first. But when I lose pressure, I'm gonna want you to close it. Right. I'm gonna start on the third floor. We got two bathrooms up here and a laundry room.
hear the pressure difference on a 1.0 flow on the laboratory faucet? I feel like they got no pressure. Give us some juice. Give us some juice. Alright. Gotta create a suction for us. See how much pressure here is on the sink? Yeah. You think there's no air pressure in the system? It's the actual flow of the faucet. It's like a one point, it's a water saver faucet. Alright, you should be good. Now here's the pressure of a toilet flow. There's no restriction, ready? That's a lot of pressure. It's because it's because I have the whole hot water here filled with air. It's on warm. Start this joker up. Get ready. Here it comes. <laughs> Come on, be good to daddy right here. You just gotta make sure you go through each unit, each bathroom, process of elimination. And the only good thing is here is he keeps his heat on here. Yeah, right? Yeah, 55. You don't like it to get damp. I can't read that. What's that say back there, Ange? On or off? This is off on the right side. Front or back? Oh, it's on right now. It's on, okay. All right, we're gonna let that run through. Oh, there it goes. Now it's gonna blow out all the washer lines, hot and cold, into the washer. And then we're gonna pour antifreeze in this for the drain line. Here comes the hot. Dishwashers, which here I happened to be last year. I'm going to pump it out and then I'm going to turn it off the valve because the cylinder like, takes forever to uh, close and it won't stop. So here we go. We'll blow it out and then we will shut the valve off. I right, pump out that toy, Andrew. Okay. Yeah. Did you turn it off? Already? Yes. What's this say? I did fly. Well, you can check it. Go ahead. Auto. Start. Oh, there it is. Start. Come on. Auto. On. And start. Here it goes. So we're looking to blow out the dishwasher, too. Come on now, don't make daddy a liar. Let's go. Here it comes. Don't worry, you'll be out of here. And make sure you move them rugs, okay? Just don't get any water on nothing. All right, I'm just, I just moved the kitchen while I just want to remind you. And we gotta do the ice maker too. The water dispenser.
here it goes. Blow in air. Two at once. Can I see your rag in? And the uh, watch how you set in order. Okay. Dishwasher and the, what do you call it? The uh, water dispenser. So, stupid little things. All these modern contraptions. Trust me, the next two we do ain't nothing like this. <laughs> Double check. Don't dump in there. Here. Oh, okay. Open up your coal faucet. No, no, no. Up here. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't uh, shut the valves off. Shut it off. Check your hot. All right. Open your twelve valve real slow because this one, this valve's old. Good job. Clean that up and I'll see you downstairs. Unhook the compressor now. I got plenty of air in the system. Shut the valve off. We got three things to do yet. Let me show you something. What I just did was this. I unhooked the uh, compressor, I shut it off. Yeah. I shut at this. The red, at the red valve? Yeah. I shut this off, so now the whole system is filled with air. We got three things to drain yet. This shower. That's the cold. There's the hot. A little bit of air. Okay. A little bit of pressure, huh? Now last, but not least, the shower. Cold. Now we just gotta do the outside bib and the water meter box. This should, all, this should already be done. The last piece of pie besides antifreeze is this. So we're gonna get the air out of the water main, which is real short. It goes from, it goes right from that valve right there to here. But we don't want this to freeze up, so we back, we blow it out with air also. Right now everything's off, right? So now I'm gonna open up this here, expansion joint. Stories with, I told Chucky. All right, so now look, that's open, right? Let's open up the, the house side. Right here, dog. So now we're gonna open this up and get all the air out. We might get a little bit of water here. Still under pressure, right? There it is. All the air pressure out. get a rep for this. I did order one online for $24.99. Let's get her done, buddy. And a little bit of antifreeze off traps. You know this will probably never freeze. We'll still do it. 
We all, we always wipe the antifreeze out. Okay. Wipe more, more trash. All right, buddy. This way it looks nice and clean when they come down. Just a little bit in each sink, like so. Okay. All right, pal. Done deal. What's all this? Big basket. Okay. All right, you're the antifreeze man. Oh, hold on. Always a splash in the dishwasher for the drain. Just like so. Nah, that'll get washed out. It is a. Uh, it's friendly antifreeze. A little bit in the zinc. Make sure you wipe all that dirt out of there, okay? Yeah. A little bit in the toilet. The tank's empty, right? Yeah. All right. I'll go grab the other gallon. A little bit in each tank. Toilet. Shower drain. Close that toilet lid and that door once you wake that floor down in the shower. Alright? Can I fix that one, please? So, Connor? Always a little bit of antifreeze in the washer machine. Open that one up, Angie. No, the other bottle of antifreeze. Now, of course, you got to pour some down the drain here. Hammer that rag, please. Hit that sink and toilet, and pour okay. some of the tub drain. And you're golden. Good job, good job. Look, here's how I did my cords, look. Helter Skelter in there. Your first winterization. <coughs> you better have it down because you're going to do the next one in about 10 minutes. You ready? I guess so. Alright. Anyway, we got her done. Did we get her done? We got her done. No, did we get her done? We got her done. Did we get her done? Alright. Go ahead. And there goes another satisfied customer. We'll see you at the next one.